same same weight bearing, you know? Like, yo, if you get booked for a show, like, I get nervous. If I get if I have a book for a show or something like this, and there's, like, a lot of good guys, I'm like, oh, snap. I feel like I get nervous, like, I get for a fight. Similar nerves. Yeah, dog. Really? Like, yeah, bro. I think about it, you know, because you want to perform, right? You want to do good, yeah. dog. You know? But it's like a fear. It's like a flight or, fl- fight or flight thing. Yeah, you feel it. You feel it. Especially, like, my first couple. You know what I'm saying? I got nervous yesterday. I still get nervous. All Where the time. You... All right. Boom. That's a good one. Where did you perform yesterday? Red Bar. A red bar. That's a good spot. I dropped right? in, you know. I I, uh, I passed by because I wanted to do a spot for some reason. I was just having a day, you know, and I was like, I need to do this, you know. And first set of the year, bro, right? First. Or did you get up? And- of, did I get up before? Did I get up on? Oh, that was my phone. No worries, bro. Bit. Did I get up on? Uh, yeah. Did I get up before? No, I don't think so. Saturday, yeah. Sunday. No, no, no. Saturday, Sunday for me, you know. So you got your first set of the year done on Red Bar? How yeah. was it? It was pretty good. It was good it was a hot crowd. Yeah, this is like, we're like in the afterglow right now of like the party season here. Yes. So everyone's still here. Everyone's still having a good time. So that shit was packed. Everyone had great energy. All of the shows have been really good lately. Yes, everywhere has been packed, dog. Thank you, Miami was packed on Friday and Monday, yep. both years, both nights. You yep. know what I'm saying? Now we just got to wait till fucking February so everyone's miserable again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dog. We'll let the fucking, fucking New Year's journey val- wait off, Valentine's dog. crowd is fucking going to be rough. After three weeks of like the same old shit, you're like, all right, nothing's changed. We're still assholes. Yeah, we're still the same <laughs> shit. Like, you know, it might as well be fucking the year 2500, bro. Nothing changes. <laughs> <laughs> it might as well be in time in 2564, <laughs> dog. <laughs> 2564. Oh, man. That's not even a special number, dude. You can't even freak out. Yeah, and, uh, yo, people always ask me. They're always like, yo, when do you not get nervous for like couple of my students and stuff? They'll ask me for fights. Like, when do you not get nervous? And I'm like, well, you know, it's not that you don't get nervous, that you learn how to deal with the nerves better. Yeah, or like it starts feeling good. Like, because that's what happened to me at Red Bar. I got nervous, bro. Because the, the show started off really hot. It was nice. Good laughs. I'm up second. And out of nowhere, I'm like, Ah, fuck, maybe that set list that I was thinking of was not a good idea. And then you get this fucking, you get this, like, doubt thing, and you're like, ah, fuck, I'm a piece of shit, I'm gonna go up there and eat a dick. And then usually when I have that feeling, I do good. Yo! If I don't have that feeling, if I'm not nervous, it's like, you don't try as hard, it's like, something, something doesn't get to you, so I like feeling that anxiety still, you know? I love, dog, that's fun. You just explained getting ready for a fight, bro. It's the same thing? Dog, you looking at the set list? Bro, on fight day, sometimes you wake up, you're like, yo, why do I do this? You know, you're like, <laughs> who? why do i sign up for this like you're making weight you know you're dieting you're just like what is going on here you know and then but when the moment happens like when the bell rings it's like when you get up and the guy introduces you and you grab the microphone you're like and whatever you say yeah you're in train you're like there's you're not in training mode anymore yeah and then just doing it and then the cruise control hits right yeah you go into that like flow state you feel that in comedy a lot right yeah yeah but when you have a good set the time just burns like fast or you just think of other things while you're up there like sometimes it takes a while but you're just like like I've I've done sets and like tried to sneak a fart that I knew was <laughs> oh, yeah. gonna be a shit, you know. But like it's just you're telling a joke and then you're like, that's not good either. If you get too autopilot, it's like, well, what you know? Are you trying anything new? <laughs> I'm fucking trying to control the muscles of my asshole yeah. to like <laughs> squeeze the shit. Out. Yo, they have no idea that like, you're on stage, like just blowing. Like yo, you have no idea that like, oh, my god. Oh no, they have an idea, bro. They sit right up you here, think- dude. <laughs> And thank you, Miami. They're mad close, bro. I'm always like, I always want to tell them, yo, I could, if I fart right now, I'll just fart right on their nose, you know? You have the power. That's my, that's my, like, that's my cauliflower ear, you know? Like, I have cauliflower asshole. I sit down there, I have, I'm confident because I'm like, I could just ruin your fucking night tonight. Easy. I just you, walk by after my set. You don't even notice. Have you legit- Never done it because that's fucking psychopath shit, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, I, have you- have you ever like farted and like I wonder if you could fart and then you can see the crowd like if anybody they, they're trying to figure out what it was and you're just talking the whole time and people are like well I think I think I've seen that like early on and <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> like early open mics like there's just you know you you got nothing and I've seen guys like just be like yeah just full disclosure guys just had a brutal fart <laughs> and then people get up people get up they go like oh I don't want I don't want to deal with this shit they get up and they leave yeah you like you do a you do a cut right in there in front of everybody yeah bro like you got to fucking just you know you got to you got to you got to have you got to keep that in the chamber you can't let it go you got to keep it in the chamber we'll register weapons dude that's that's, that's most comics assholes yeah <laughs> <laughs> i don't give a shit <laughs>